All right. So um, in nature, you know, people like, for example, hunter gatherers, they are uh, like the American Indians, for example, they had no word for work. Like they would just go like people today when they want to, you know, take a break from their life and, you know, take a vacation or something, they go hunting, they go fishing and that's their break from life. And, you know, they get to go on a two day weekend to hunt or fish and then they go back to their boss and they work their ass off and then they give 40 percent of their money to the government. And then they have all these health problems they have to worry about constantly, which primitive people never had to worry about. And, you know, they end up living, you know, a horrible life. People are not happy at all. In primitive times, you know, people, you know, they were free. They were on the land. They had, you know, a sense of identity rather than what we have now, which is like a globalist type world culture where everyone's the same, like, you know, you, you, you go to, you go here, I'll go down the block. Everyone will be wearing fitted backwards, fitted caps and their pants are hanging down their ass and you go to Africa or Japan and you'll see the same thing. You know, no one has their own culture anymore and they're lost. They don't have, you know, family ties and like things that bring them meaning to their life. They don't have individual cultures. And, um, it, it gets to the point where like, you know, we're not human anymore. We're just, cogs in a machine and in primitive society you know we did have to worry about things like you know maybe a bear is gonna you know come and eat our baby while we're sleeping and things like that but it's like like this goes beyond just logic for me it's like when i'm out in nature with you know away from everything you know when i don't see there's no helicopter hovering above me there's no cars going by and i have my feet on the grass and the animals are all around me and I'm breathing fresh air. Like it's like immediate peace. And the fact that I have to go back to my normal life after that, every time it just like, it always breaks my heart. And it's like, um, when you, you know, with the stuff like tribal warfare, it's like, Oh, you don't. So you want to go back to a time when a rival tribe can like kill you and rape your woman and everything. And it's like, yeah, I'd rather go back to that time where I was free up until that point where I got an ax in my head and, you know, I had to fight and stuff because even like fighting, you know, people are against it, but it's like, you know, animals do it like rams. They beat the shit out of each other. Wolves beat the shit out of each other. Like this is just nature, like just people, like just animals just being what they are. And I think it's so beautiful even the bloody and gory parts. And it's like people, they say like fighting's bad and all this stuff. It's like, you know, I've never attacked anyone in my life. I've never been in a fight outside of self-defense, but it's like every time I've been in a fight, it's like the most alive I've ever felt. Like, especially if you win, it's like, there's no better feeling than like someone attacking you and you just, they just end up a bloody pulp on the ground. Like this is better than any feeling I could get in this society. So I'm like, it's all good to me. And that's what I want. I want like the love of like a tribal society where everyone knows each other and knows everything about each other. They know each other's families and they work together as a group, like not this individual stuff that we have now. Like I like, you know, I don't like individualism. Like right now I'm individualistic because I don't fit in a society, but I'd like to be, you know, in like a primitive state, which, you know, probably will never happen. But, you know, I see how these people live. Like even today there's primitive people and there's documentaries about them. And it's like, I'm so jealous of them. You know, I wish I had what they have. And some people, they like progress and science and just like getting to the next thing. Let's get to the moon. Let's get to this. But to me, it just like destroys my soul. 